part two begins. Look at this. Press the aisle. Come pick this out. You might not hurt. Look. Beach erosion. You can see where it's happening right here. This is part two, two of my video. I mean, this is insane. All, all of the other ways are just the only ways you've taken away the beach. Look at that. That's crazy. Yeah, there isn't much. It's just a rose. Wow, when big waves come through, they come crashing, take the beach with them. So not much else is happening. Oh. Look what the flooding's done here. Yeah. That's all beach, it's washed out. Yeah. Like that's probably a 10-foot cliff right there. Not quite that many feet, most. This is just Yeah, this you used to be able to walk out straight out into the water and out. It's literally a cliff of sand. I wonder what this winter is going to bring with the glacial ice caps melting. They said August and September globally was the second, third warmest months on record. Wow. It might have been the warmest August on record worldwide, but I can't remember. the Lake Erie wind today. It's very insane as you can see. Waves. Waves. So sorry about the bad audio. Hope there's a little bit of that. Alright guys, here's thing danger prohibited. We'll see why this is a prohibited area. Oh man. Look at them way. Hold on. Guys, this is gonna have to be quick, but look at this. This is where we we you know, left off last time. And look. This is what remains. This is just sad bro. Guess what? All the melting glaciers washed in by Lake Erie. Then what happens is all the water comes rushing in and and then all when and then all the water just comes up and then when that happens all the glaciers come in it it's it sinks down I mean I think it's just snows just more dense so it pushes down all the sand and then as it melts it washes it all back into Lake Erie Making the level, the Lake Erie level, water level slightly higher, and then the process repeats. They get the waves get higher. No, the water levels rise, and it pushes in more, 
and then it just ends up pushing in more glaciers. So yeah, that's what's happening. And this is what it looks like after all the snow has just left. Look at, look at those waves. This is what's causing it. Holy crap, dude. There's a road right there. And guess what? Look what's happened. All this. This is beach road. Like, watch this. See? This is crumbling. See, look. These extreme waves are just taking it away. If you don't remember, guess what? The glacial ice caps. They, all the all the snowing, the melting glaciers came in to the shoreline, and guess what? This happened. The melting glaciers from the warmest climates have caused this to happen. It, like I said, all the glacial these snow and stuff moving in, and then it just and then it washes out and leaves. Yeah. So that's what happened. And then eventually when it all melts, and then eventually when it all melts, it just goes back into the ocean, making the Lake Gary level slightly higher every year, and then boom. And it just, and it comes in closer and closer. In the next 50 to 100 years, this place will be underwater. I bet you. All right, so, yep. Gotta go, because it's a prohibited air. Yeah, but. Well, if there's any more things, I'll let you know.